Having dealt with many ups and downs, what's our girl Selena Gomez doing to find peace and ultimately be a happier and healthier version of herself? She's made some big changes over the past year. For one, she got the heck out of LA and moved south to Orange County, telling Elle magazine, I think everything in my life is being majorly downsized. LA's just gotten really claustrophobic for me. She added, I'm going back to simplicity. That's always who I've been. It's not me saying I feel the best I've ever felt. It's me saying I'm exactly where I am. And I'm so happy I'm in this place. It's a lot of self-discovery. Selena, who's been open about her lupus diagnosis, is prioritizing both her physical and mental health. In September of 2018, she announced that she was taking a social media break despite being one of the most followed people on Instagram. Then in October, Selena entered a treatment facility to help address ongoing issues related to anxiety and depression. At the time, an insider told E! News, Selena has been trying really hard recently to remain focused and not let her health affect her. She has been actively writing new music and moved to Orange County for a change of pace and a fresh breath of air. Ultimately, with all of her arising health issues, Selena started to feel super overwhelmed. In December, Gomez re-emerged, looking happy and healthy on a ski trip with friends. Gomez continues to be vocal about the negative impacts of social media. Social media has really been terrible for my generation. I understand that it's amazing to use your platform, but it does scare me when you see how exposed that these young girls and young boys are. I think it's dangerous for sure. But that doesn't mean she's abandoned IG. Selena revealed that she still uses the app, but doesn't have it on her phone. She has it on someone else's phone, and when she wants to share something, she does. The now 27-year-old remains committed to helping others and giving back. Gomez has been interning at A21, a global anti-human trafficking nonprofit. I've been wanting something that I felt like I could contribute most of my time to because I love what I do, but I feel a little selfish sometimes, and I've always said that. So what does Selena's era of rebuilding have to bring? Fans are anxiously awaiting new music. I've wanted to take my time and be intentional with it. I'm very proud of it. I think it's going to be exciting. I know it's it's you know annoying for me to not say when, but it will be soon. In June, the pop star told Jimmy Fallon that her next album is actually done except for a few finishing things. She explained that it took her four years to feel at a good place with her album because of huge moments that happened in her life personally. This newer version of Selena continues to be focused on the simple things. When people ask me what's one thing that you really hope people know about you, I've always kind of said it was my heart just because, you know, I can be in fancy clothes, I can have whatever things on Instagram. It's just, that's always something that I've been passionate about. We're proud of you, Selena, for all the work you've put into bettering yourself and the inspiration you are to others. Thirsty for more celeb news? Make sure you subscribe to the E! News YouTube channel so you can stay informed on all the breaking updates. Come on, you know you want to be the first to know about all the latest hookups, breakups, arrests, and so much more.